I'm Martin Young and my company is called Sitting Spiritually which was founded in 2004. We were visited by the National Garden Scheme in 2003 who were quite keen for us to open the garden up for charity and they said it's a lovely garden but it's only a third of an acre and we need to keep people interested for 45 minutes. Have you ever thought of getting seating to slow people down? And I'd always hankered after a swing seat, to be honest, American films and porches and things like that. And I thought, right, I'll go and buy one. And what I saw that was available here in the UK, I was quite surprised at the quality. There was nothing there that appealed to me. And I finished up sending for a blueprint from, as they call it, from America. And when it arrived, I made this swing seat and I set it in the garden and opened the garden up in 2004 with the National Garden Scheme. And that very first day, three people, obviously thinking along similar lines to me, said, that's nice, where did you get that? And I suddenly realised that the, 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 there's an opportunity here. And, and, and the name also to the business came about with I was sitting down on this new seat one morning because I'm quite interested in meditation and I'm sitting down this seat in, a, in quite a relaxed meditative state one morning and a mate of mine comes walking into the garden unbeknown to me and said you know are you sitting spiritually and I, then I'll begin and I thought what a fantastic name. right from the beginning thought well if I'm going to make these things I'm going to make them with a 25 year life expectancy and I still do that today. The whole emphasis has been on style, on design, on aesthetically pleasing comfortable seats but also seats that uh, are going to last a long time. So I set about finding a species of tree here in the UK which was of sufficient quality to enable me to make these seats and I found a great source of British oak, of chestnut and of western red cedar. I buy it in through one local guy, he sources it from the managed estate. So having chosen those woods we set about doing a, a, a comfortable seat but with a variation of styles of backs. And there are a network of joiners, of which I've now got six, that work within a three mile radius of where we are here in Lyme Regis. My name is James and I've been with Sitting Spiritually since the very early days. When I get the order, a duplicate order is placed with the timber merchant. I check the quality of the timber. Anything I don't think is good enough, he replaces. Then I take it into the workshop and then the responsibility is on me to handcraft the product you see here. And this is a piece I've been working on recently. It's a Tranquility Oak three-seater fan back, which is one of the most popular products in the range of seats. There's a particularly nice back piece on this one. One of the bonuses of using English oak is you get much stronger medullary rays in the oak, which remain as the silvers over time. This detail will remain, and uh, it's a nice sign of good quality timber. The commonest expression that I get from people is, I, I've been looking for years for something like this. I didn't believe there was anybody that made really good quality, high-end garden swing seats that looked good and also were comfortable to sit on. So I'm, I, I think we've achieved that. In 2008, I went to Chelsea Flower Show with a friend and we were embarking on a lot of building at that stage and the garden. And I said, when it's all finished, I'm going to buy myself one of those garden swings. Probably in about two years time, but it was more like four, I think. We decided we didn't want any sort of carving on the back of it. And then over lunch, I said, well, we could have at last on it. And Ian said, no, we won't, we'll have finally. Um, uh, worth waiting four or five years for. <laughs> it's a nice feeling to be running a business creating things with your hands. The whole process from start to finish uh, is one of care and attention to detail. It's very, very important to me 